Hi, if you're watching this, it's probably because you're interested in how we move, and perhaps even in using knowledge about how we move to help people who can't move so well. Um, that's the purpose of this course. Uh, my name is Mark Summer. I'm in the Department of Biomedical Engineering and Center for Cognitive Neuroscience and a lot of neuroscience programs on campus. And I offer in the spring a course called Neural Control of Movement. Um, in this course, we study the neurobiology of movement all the way from the motor cortex down to the muscles themselves. And at each step of the way, we consider the circuits that actually allow you to move um, every second of every day of your waking life. So this includes um, the brain itself and the gray matter that you're familiar with, which is also mostly motor cortex M1. It includes circuits underneath there that you may not think about very often. The cerebellum, which is shown right here. Um, there are recurrent loops between that and the cerebral cortex. The basal ganglia in the middle, the spinal cord going all the way down and up to the muscles. If you're interested in applying neuroscience information to helping people with biomedical engineering, you should really understand how the brain actually helps people, helps you in your everyday life to move your muscles and interact with the world. And uh, that's really the underlying driving force for this course, and I hope to see you in the spring.